one of the areas where, again, you've been a continental leader is in technology, and it's something we want to talk about a lot today, the idea of how technology can drive growth. You've clearly, everybody's aware of the great successes in financial technology and Silicon Savannah, but it's a criticism that's been leveled recently about some of these technology companies that perhaps they were better at getting headlines than actually making profits. And perhaps they were more focused on um, altruism or charity in some cases uh, rather than profitability. I'm wondering how you see that sector evolving in Kenya and what the government can do, what regulators can do to provide the best possible environment to make it profitable. Well, um, first, I think it's true we have had some companies that have been more excited about headlines, more excited <laughs> about explaining what new widget or app they've come up with. Um, and uh, how this is going to solve all the problems of the world as we know them. Uh, I think what we've been pushing uh, is a sort of uh, better focusing on a particular problem, so customer focus. Mm. So don't put together an app that uh, is not focused at a particular problem. So if you have uh, uh, whatever item that they're fixing, um, so whatever innovation or innovative tool they come up with, uh, they need to ask themselves the question, what is the problem that this thing is going to address? So don't create an imaginary problem and uh, try and resolve it. Look at the problem, see what, pro and there are tons of problems out there, hundreds of problems, um, and work on that. So be focused on the customer, be focused on the needs of the customer than anything else. Now I know there's the classic uh, question or rather retort that uh, when Steve Jobs uh, put together the iPhone, um, he was asked, well, gee, did you actually go out and uh, survey the customers and so forth? And his answer was no, because customers don't know what they need. So at one level, sort of high sort of innovation, yes, it's true, um, you, you cannot quite exploit uh, sort of, uh, you can not get a good handle as to what, uh, what the gap is, what the mm -hmm. customer needs. But I don't think that happens often. Uh, most of the innovations that we are seeing are much more, let's say, they're not at that level, and therefore there is actually a particular need that you're trying to address. We are really, I think, uh, proponents of, uh, of pushing fintech. Right. There are so many problems that uh, can be resolved, and we have tons of problems that can be fixed with the technology as we have it. So I don't think it's a... Uh, there, there is a lack of opportunities. And all these opportunities, of course, are also good for the bottom line. But I think a lot of them will be transformational. 